what's going on guys it's omniarch and today i'm bringing you a brand new video where we're gonna be talking about the absolute worst channel on youtube i found it it's true i have found the worst channel on youtube lord help me god i want to quit this platform please strike me down where i sit because this is this is bad this is bad this platform is actually uh it's doomed we're doomed guys just just pack it up call it call it quits it's over youtube's over everyone go home youtube's over just cut it we're done now i know what you're thinking right you and i both know youtube is one of the biggest platforms on the entire internet it's one of the biggest websites in the entire world it's owned by google we've got millions and millions and millions of active users i felt like donald trump right there with the billions and billions and bi billions and billions and billions and billions and billions and billions and you get the point we have tons of active users on this platform there's bound to be thousands and thousands of awful channels and it, it's gotten worse in the last couple of years i remember complaining about clickbait back in like 2012 and 2014 and 2016 and it's at an all-time high right now there's no signs of clickbait slowing down um it was at its peak over the summer when we talked about all of the fortnite clickbait garbage uh, and with that being said, you know, I'm, I'm acknowledging with you that I understand that this is a massive platform and there's tons of garbage. There's bound to be tons of garbage, tons of terrible channels, but I stand by what I'm saying. I don't think it's clickbait that I'm telling you that I think this is the worst channel on YouTube. I legitimately feel in the bottom of my heart that this channel is garbage and it's for a couple of different reasons. And the part that makes me want to literally just delete my channel and quit YouTube forever is how many subscribers this channel has. And I know what you're thinking. You're probably thinking I'm going to say something like the Paul brothers or like rice gum or something like that. No, no, no. It's not one of those guys. I know that their channels are pretty garbage. Although I do find rice gum somewhat entertaining, although he hasn't been funny to me in a little over a year, but regardless, it's not one that you would typically expect. And I didn't even know that this channel existed until I stumbled upon it. And I found it because I went through one of those YouTube black holes, you know, when you click on a video and you watch it and then you, you watch the recommended video and then you see a video on the sidebar and you click on that. And then it brings you to another thing. Next thing you know, you've been on YouTube for an hour and 45 minutes and all you've watched are some random things that weren't even even close to what you originally clicked on and that's how I ended up on this channel and I'm sure by now you guys are thinking okay Omniarch you gotta just tell us what the channel is man you gotta just let us know what's the worst channel on YouTube and I'm here to tell you that the name of the channel is apex TV now you guys might not have heard of this channel uh, it's a channel that has to do with what it quotes is mystery and science that is what the banner says of this youtube channel so apex tv what is so bad about apex tv it's just another channel about mystery and science everybody loves mystery and science well they take clickbait to a whole new dimension i'm not kidding i'm not kidding i i didn't i didn't say whole new level i said a whole new dimension and by that i mean every single one of their videos okay i'd say about 90 to 95 percent of all of their videos in the last 11 to 12 months have been about confirmed time travelers i'm not kidding this channel claims to be interviewing real time travelers now, it's one thing to complain about Fortnite clickbait, right? Because the title in the thumbnail says, oh my God, are we getting Spider-Man as a skin in Fortnite? And you click on it and it's not true. This channel takes that to a whole nother level. Not only are they claiming with their titles and their thumbnails to be interviewing and talking to and talking about real living breathing time travelers the videos are actually staged to where they are literally lying to you like they they have a person there they're interviewing a person the person's face is blurred out a lot of times their voice is altered because quote unquote 
these people are being chased by the government so they can't reveal their identity wow how convenient you can't reveal their identity it's almost like you're fucking lying holy shit so every single one of the videos and i'm gonna put up some thumbnails here on, on the screen right i'm gonna go through a couple of these just in case you guys have never seen this gem of a channel their most recent video time traveler who went to 2600 tells unbelievable story holy shit i better click on that i need to hear what the literal time traveler said who went to 2600 here's another one time traveler who has been to the year 4413 speaks out you're telling me this man went over 2000 years into the future get the fuck out of here bro the worst part is that this channel has 794,000 subscribers they have almost a million subscribers from this shit, from literally staging videos claiming to interview time travelers who have their identity concealed because it's convenient for them, they lie about the clickbait, the title, and the thumbnail, and the entire video is crafted to be completely fake, and they're delivering it to you as if it were true. It's not like these videos have a disclaimer that say, for entertainment purposes only, or for educational purposes only, or whatever the case is. It's not like they're, you know, they're, they reveal that they're actors or that these are ads for something no no this channel is literally making youtube videos that is legitimately claiming to be interviewing and talking to and talking about time travelers with no no indication that that they're even trying to tell their audience that this is fake and the worst part not only are there almost 800,000 people subscribed to this channel, but most of their videos have good ratings. They have 77%, 79%, 80% ratings. Dude, if I post a video, a Call of Duty gameplay, where I get a 1.45 KD, I get worse ratings than that. I mean, seriously, guys, what, what has YouTube come to? Let's look at another one. Time Traveler, who went to the year 8,073. Holy shit! 8,073. Dude, I better click on that video. And the thumbnail's got a dude with glasses. You're telling me they wear glasses in 8,973, dude? How about this one? Time traveler caught on tape, parentheses, real teleportation, question mark? Dude, I can't believe Apex TV caught teleportation on camera. It's not like he could just edit that shit. That video has 336,000 views, by the way. <laughs> but this one time traveler who saw dinosaurs 60 million years ago men in black caught on tape real footage what am i doing wrong what am i doing wrong on youtube where i have 6,000 beautiful incredible subscribers mind you i'm grateful for every single one of you guys but what am i doing wrong and apex tv is doing right am i not lying enough am i not spewing garbage to the internet enough am i not taking advantage of my viewers enough am i not taking advantage of clickbait enough youtube seriously what is this platform turning into where you have a channel with nearly a million subscribers who is literally not only clickbaiting the title and thumbnail but clickbaiting and manufacturing a whole fake channel everything on the channel is fake it's all fake and none of it is is being claimed to be fake like like entertainment or anything they are only getting clicks and views because they're literally claiming that these things are true and the worst part is think about the army of people that watch these videos dude think about how many people with their tinfoil hats on subscribe to this channel and tune in every every other day every third day to see the latest news about time travelers like this is doing damage to people dude this is doing literal damage to, to to our culture and to our community this is like tainting the minds of, of impressionable youths like people are gonna see this and literally think that this is real they're gonna think that believing this shit is normal when it's not because there's the whole psychology of of social proof right if somebody thinks you know uh what if time travelers are real and then they come across this channel and they're gonna be like oh my god dude almost a million other people think about time travelers and they think that they're real too like there might be something to this like no no 
time travel is fake it's a it's in your imagination don't worry the guy who makes this channel is is robbing you of your time and your attention that's all he's doing he's converting your time your consciousness into money that he can put in his pocket and as long as you are clicking on these videos and subscribing to seeing what the latest time traveler is talking about it's going to continue to happen and it's going to get worse and we're going to see more channels just like this people are going to say interviewing a real zombie who fought in the civil war oh my god a real zombie holy shit i better click on the video like dude i i'm i'm literally i'm actually appalled on multiple levels i'm appalled that people believe this i'm appalled at how many people believe this i'm deeply upset and concerned for the people that actually watch these videos like legitimately like i said they all have 70 80 percent ratings so people who watch this obviously are enjoying the content i'm partially upset at youtube for letting something like this exist like you're literally letting some how is that science seriously how is that science how is time travel science can you can you scientifically show me time travel no you can't because it's not science it's science fiction okay there's a, it's completely different if i post a video faking a, a rocket shooting out of my asshole is that science no it's science fiction although that's more likely than time travel because i could just put a firework in my ass hey siri play i'm upset by drake time traveler caught on 911 call live interview the video's two hours long and it has 700,000 views do you know how many ads that man ran on that video i guarantee you he made a boatload of money off of that video the well-being of our society cannot handle this we can't take this seriously this is this is one of the worst things that's ever happened to YouTube. I actually do think this is the worst channel. I really think that this is the actual, the worst channel. I mean, the fact that it's been around for so long, that it's grown so big, and all it's done in its entirety of its, of its existence is produce fake content that it's lying about and saying that it's real, and then utilizing clickbait techniques with clickbait thumbnails, clickbait titles the entire channel is 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 fake and this is actually what's what's wrong with youtube right this is actually the problem is that youtube doesn't mind channels like this uh because it's advertiser friendly there's probably no cursing there's no blood or gore or anything like that so it's advertiser friendly content um and it won't mind pushing this into the algorithm but the problem is that it's all fake none of it's real this is all fake content and i wouldn't even be that upset if they tried to say oh like this is in the bottom of the description or something like oh like this is all fiction or whatever like something but really what's happening is apex tv is gaming the youtube system and they're being pushed into the alg algorithms while they lie to you guys uh, and then people who are creating legitimate content that, that have skill at something, people who are skilled at, at making music or at, at being a good gamer or anything, people who actually have talent and people who are entertaining, those people are buried at the bottom of the barrel and they will never escape so long as we have giant channels like this who mass produce clickbait garbage and pass it off as truth. It's 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 terrible for the platform and it really is is it makes Makes me not want to be a part of the YouTube community okay with that serious note aside hopefully you guys enjoyed this video if you did make sure you smack the like button comment down below telling me what you think about this am I being too harsh on apex TV what do you guys think let me know have you heard of them before I don't even know if you made it all the way to the end of the video how about we put a, a little alien a little alien emoji in the comment section below so I know you made it all the way to the end because those are probably real according to apex TV as well <laughs> dude I'm not even kidding time traveler who met aliens in the year 4000 you can't even make this up dude what oh my god guys you got to comment with the alien emoji down down below um like i said smack the like button subscribe if you're new around here smack that bell button boy so that way uh you get more notifications when i upload new videos and that's a bit guys so thank you so much for watching this has been omniarch i will talk to you guys again soon peace